everybody. Today I saw this post of a, a user who would like to be able to copy URLs and article titles, so the title of an article, into um, a uh, automation so that they can paste it into a Gmail um, email, let's just say. And then, so I figured, wait a minute, this has to be an easy automation that I've already done. Well, I did have the automation for uh, copying uh, a URL, but what I didn't have was copying the title of the article. So I found an Apple script and was able to combine both um, scripts into one um, text expander snippet so that it um, pastes the article as well as the URL. So um, let's see how it works. I have here one um, URL, URL and an article title, and I think this will work on this page. So we have um, this page right here, and we only have one window. Let's try it out. Okay, so I'm gonna open Text Expand, or not Text Expander, but Drafts. And I'm going to say drafts, and then I'm going to pay, type the snippet that I've set up. So news, I called it dollar sign news. Start again, dollar sign news. So here it gives you, gives you copy a page title and URL from Chrome and paste as a hyperlink in Gmail. Well, okay, I guess I misread it. I copied the hyperlink from a um, Safari page, and this is what I got. So, as you can see, it works, and it will do this with whatever uh, URL is the frontmost tab. So if I had, for example, uh, let's go to the Wall Street Journal and let's open here, this article here. Pepsi's new diet, more chips and soda. So here we go. There's the article, and it's the one that's open in the uh, Safari um, browser. So we have it open now. Let's um, go back to drafts, hit return, and then do news again. And here you go. It types the um, title at the top, and then the URL at the bottom. So let's take a look at the text expander snippets that are combined to make this work. I open a text expander, and here is the Apple script for um, copying the uh, Safari uh, the title within Safari. So it says, it's a simple script. It says, tell application Safari, set my title to name of current tab in window one. I only have one window. And it opens the, the current active tab. So that's the first one. And then um, let's take a look at the SURL snippet. Remember, I have 
uh, two snippets that are combined into one to make this work. So SURL is for Safari snippet. And here it is, current Safari URL. And it, they're actually both um, uh, Apple scripts. So it tells, tell application Safari to return URL of current tab of window one. So that's a one liner. And it, if you combine both of them into this one, and I have, I'll show it to you combined. News. And I, here's the one, news article. I called it news article. And I simply put the snippet abbreviations. So it puts the title at the top and then the URL at the bottom. And this is the end result. I hope um, this is helpful. You can probably also combine um, both of them into one script, except for me, this is neater. So I hope um, this helps and I will post this video as a response to the user's article or the user's um, forum question, and hopefully we can help them out. Um, so, and the this is how you can use automate automation to copy a URL title as well as the URL address down here. And to be honest with you, I wish that I had this snippet while I was in school. It would have saved me a lot of time when doing uh, bibliographies and referencing my sources. Um, this would have been a tremendous help. Unfortunately, I didn't know about Text Expander or anything like that. If you like um, Text Expander, uh, check out my link below. All right, everybody, that's all I have for today. And I hope you liked it. Please subscribe, like, and comment below. And I will see you all in the next video. Oh,